Saskatchewan's farm real estate market is scorching. Statistics Canada released balance sheets of the agricultural sector that show the state of affairs in each province since 1981. Data shows the value of farm real estate in Saskatchewan stagnated for more than a quarter century. But the value has climbed steadily since 2008, rising from about $28 billion then to more than $114 billion in 2022. That includes a record $13.7 billion growth from 2021 to 2022. I mean, the world needs more of Saskatchewan, needs more of Canada when it comes to food production. And I think it reflects, you know, the increase in asset values reflect the positive outlook that people in the industry would have of, of the sector. Experts say farmland has become more valuable because of the global demand for food. Supply chain issues from the pandemic and the war in Ukraine have only added to that demand. But experts point to the free market as the main driver. Researchers estimate investors and large corporations only own about 2% of Saskatchewan's farmland, but the extra competition has pushed up the value. And if you are interested in buying land and there's three or four buyers where there might have been one or two previously, then chances are uh, the seller is going to be able to ask a higher price. The University of Regina associate professor is among those concerned about how this affects young farmers and smaller farms. Agricultural census data shows small to mid-sized farms have dwindled over the past 45 years, while the number of large farms has grown. Many young farmers, like Morgan Fallensby, can't afford to buy land due to higher property values. And we kind of had an opportunity where there was some land to buy, really close to our farm. And I went to FCC, chatted with them, and I realized, you know, I wouldn't be able to make the payments, even with, like, producing the crop, that I, would ha I wouldn't make the income. I'd have to use my income off-farm to make the payments for this. Experts say helping young farmers enter the industry is a major policy discussion in agriculture. But there isn't one single solution. Nicholas Frew, CBC News, Regina.